very 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 warm welcome and to game number one of uh, those wonderful fights in the early rounds from GCS2 series in the qualifying tournament we have at the moment our two fighters between us Caesar versus the hooligan both very strong players both very new in the tournament act and are not that often seen probably in uh, the couple of years before but both players are shining at the moment in the auto match as well as in streaming Caesar a very known person at the moment and uh, just winning most likely all the games they just playing they are top 20 have a good chance to shining in this tournament and to tell the pros that there are new pros around and yeah you have just Caesar at the moment as our wonderful OKW, so a new faction, not the standard factions like Austria versus the Soviets. With the Dawn. Oh, very interesting uh, doctrine choice. Fortification doctrine, not seen that often anymore in a 1v1 at least. Then we have the Special Operation doctrine, uh, most likely used because of the infiltration tactics and the Command Panther, Colin. And as well the Luftwaffe Crown Force with Fallschirmjäger. Strong units, Special Force units, which dealing with most infantry. If they get vetted. Holigan, meanwhile, we have Soviet. And he is just also trying to start probably with um, T2 after a couple of conscript builds. And he has armored assault tactics, uh, very the often seen in the la since the last patch. Guard mortar doctrine as well, coordination doctrine to be honest. And uh, then guard rifle combined arms, all three doctrines often seen in 1v1 since the last patch. And very, very lovely played from all of them. So we have a normal start from both sides. Um, uh, Caesar decided to go for um, a cutoff point for the fuel on the left side, which works perfectly for him. You have to retrieve the um, storm pioneers, but that's okay. He's getting control over um, his own fuel and have still two VPs in the hands and let at the moment the holy gun a bit bleeding. Nice flank here from both sides. You're seeing a early tag up from the holy gun. He just goes for Molotov, so. He have now something stronger against those infantry, which doing a lot of damage here. Seeing another nice Molotov, and he just runs into it. Caesar, mistake, big mistake here. Have to leave his fuel point on the right side, but they are coming. Even another Volkswagen idea to help out and hopefully holding those fuel point. Meanwhile, left side, he's able to probably get the fuel point under control as well so we're seeing maybe in control of two uh, fuel points but it looks like holding in can decapping the right one as well so not that bad to losing the left one the holding in could sh be holding at least one VP that's the point nice uh, dodging around over those um, uh, Molotovs, not with the Falls, but at least with the Storm Pioneers. Seeing first Maxim on the field from the Holigan. He's also trying at the moment to get the cover away, which is just probably annoying a bit for him. Those little kind of vehicles here, giving Queen cover. Sadly, not a good point for Caesar. Map goes back into the hands of the other two players. We're seeing that uh, the Holigan have a good kind of control over both munitions. That's really interesting to see here. Seeing a little mistake from uh, the Holigan, but he reacting fast enough to correct those mistakes. Nice cover use from the Holigan as well on the top side. Uh, hiding behind the car, getting green cover up and holding with that kind of positioning at least probably the munition point without a lot of trouble. They are around two folks and he is probably into a Maxim. He is not reacting fast and is probably getting suppressed. One guy at least getting suppressed, have to retreating him. He is still trying to get into the building to get a better positioning here up. The bad thing is, if he goes into the building there's only one window. So he will have not a good time here to get a lot of damage up here. Nice grenade from the hooligan. Force him to get out of the building, getting too much damage and have to retreat again his squad. See Maxim dealing and can holding the fuel on the left side as well. So very good kind of point here. 
I'm sorry about those little kind of black screen. It's probably some kind of capture card problem. I will have to look into that later. So we see in at the moment two maxims on the field and two conscripts, two from everything to be honest, from the Holigan. And he can deeding a good job here to holding the map under control. We'll have at the moment two VPs under control, both the mission getting under control again. Very nice position here, but could be getting a nice one shot at uh, blob, to be honest. Folks, not sure where to go. He now there's probably a maxim around, so you have to try to flank those kind of thing. Sadly, the Maxim just gets in time up and running around, which probably will help the folks to get a good flank in, but there was still a Flamer and the Construct around, so he don't have a chance here. Seeing some uh, folks kind of use in the building. Getting a lot of damage up and don't do enough damage against those Maxim. Maxim trying to help you. Seeing the LAG from Caesar now. Tries to get some shots in. This could be very sad if it hits perfectly because this damage they deal him on one point is insanely big. Almost getting some good shots in, but not close enough into the main thing. Almost, you have to retreating soon. It's getting dangerous here. He's retreating right now. You're getting probably a lot of trouble here in the retreat path because there are two folks gonna be. But I think he's safe because of the Maxim and the. Wow, conscripts which just also get hit it from the LEG right now. It was a mine. Looks like placed from Caesar. Nice mine. Supply sector under attack. Maxim still tries to stay on the battlefield, trying to hold the fuel. You have to get in closer to have a fuel here. You don't see it. He's a bit too far away now, but he can't go more forward because of the LEG, which probably firing instantly from him. And they're coming some uh, folks as well at the moment in the battlefield. <laughs> nice dodge from uh, the Storm Pioneers. Are able to get this in point ready. Minesweeper also in time up and could uh, finding the mines here. Firing in the retreat path. Hope that he hit something. Probably. Tries now to hit the pioneers here. Oh, seeing first vehicle on the field. We're seeing Caesars. Wonderful. Super big. Fleck half track. The German power is now on the field. He's very careful with that. You don't want losing it. So he's trying just to. Hold it on his sides, moving around top and down, uh, crushing trees and other kind of uh, wood stuff to get a good point here up. We don't have any AT gun on the field at the moment, so we have a nice time here in the battlefield to um, dealing with those kind of things. the moment a bit of a quiet uh, situation here. We're seeing that um, uh, fuel points are at the moment good in the hands from Holigan again back. You have a lot of um, kind of things. He could using. Ice 2 in late game. Could tacking up at the moment probably. Just tacking up instantly to T4 and waiting for some T4085. Double, triple maxims, super strong. He could just hold him at the moment supplies. most kind of points. You can't push him top side, but then the max is doing a lot of damage against those flag half track and he can easily just sit in the building, don't getting a lot of damage up, and could just trying to getting enough damage to pushing them. Top side we're seeing some infiltration. from mines, it's called, I think. The conscripts, this kind of things. Tripwire flares. Set up nice and could just dealing with those kind of little units, single units from those kind of things. Grenade! 
Nice flame grenade here to retreat the Maxim as well. So Cedar getting the control back over his fuel on the left side. So very turn around all the time just between the fuel. Goes in both hands again and again. He's just trying to hold it. I'm not able to doing it. Conte probably getting a shot in from the LG. No. Just in time. Moved outside the range. But probably another shot goes in. Let's see if he's moving again. He's not moving again but did not get hit. Seeing now... The flag half track is available to stop at least the complete cap. And Storm Pioneers get the back and getting the fuel control back in their hands. Nice mine from uh, Caesar. Uh, I mean, the Holigan. For Caesar to retreat his Fox Energy. The question is is Caesar going for T4? It looks not like so at the moment. But we have to wait here, but we're seeing that Hodigan finally tacked up for T3 and going for a little kind of a easy counter for the flag half track, the T70, which just will hit the field in a couple of seconds on the Soviet side. There it is. The little kind of wonderful vehicle. Look at this. Little points. We're probably switch switching completely the game at the moment. If there's no mind set up from Caesar. He will have a lot of trouble. He have one Rakuten on the field. This could be helping to deal with this vehicle, but is it enough? We don't know right now. Nice grenade again. Uh, MG in a very big trouble. Could be getting down from the conscripts. Did he get the last shot? And no. Spread out. Spread out. We are under attack. The sector is at risk. Seeing the sneaky rocket and warfare at the moment around the middle. Seeing also an AT gun set up from the hooligan. Probably to counter at least now finally the flag half track that this is getting annoying a bit for him. Uh, getting a lot of damage up but he can't getting repaired here. Maybe a bit too aggressive here but he has his rocket and to have a few of this coming something up. Focusing again on the both fields. The Holy Gang will able to get his own field back. I'm probably seeing some mines again up going up on the... Uh, from the pioneers, we're seeing here some mines set up, and he's probably going for some more mines if he just capped those points. Caesar, don't using a lot of um, munition at the moment, but don't have a lot. It's 120, could upgrading another folks gun idea, or going for some more mines probably to have some better kind of map control. Everywhere is at the moment on the field. The conscript. It's like a big line of MGs, Maxims, and uh, T70 as well as NAT to support. And it looks like he found the flag after. Is he trying to shoot through the building? I don't think he was hitting it. He tries, hit the window, almost, but it wasn't enough. He's not trying to to switch to the place. Have a better feel about that. But he reacting instantly. Caesar is able to rescue his. Light vehicle, getting a nice shot from the Rakitin up against those T70, second Rakitin in front of the field as well, but he is just not able to shot another shot in. And T70 is as well safe and could be getting repaired. Sneaky Rakitin reference is a very, very dangerous thing which could happen. Two Rakitins are more than enough in close range to dealing with the T70 easily in one, two shots. Maxim still on fields will be probably able to suppress the conscripts here, but he will at least probably uh, decapping the points. Nice turnaround of the Maxim was able to retreat the folks. See, they get out of range from the Maxim finally and could capping his point back. Rocket in sneaky. In the middle, it's very sneaky. You could, you could almost see the T70, and now he's probably in the range, getting a first sh shot in. He could probably getting another shot in. Is he going for it or is he retreating? Getting another shot in hits, and T70 
70 almost down, but survived here. MG in big trouble, getting flamed and also barrage from the AT gun. He have to get out of the building, building almost down, but he gets out and with low health could just read tweeting and again fill up the complete health. Nice push from the conscript again. Uh, the F Molotov really shining for them. Seeing the next truck on the field, so he's probably setting up to T4. Let's see if he goes into the base. It looks like he will just set it up in base at the moment. But you have to wait a bit. You don't have, at the moment, a lot of um, MP on the battlefield. There's the mine getting catch from the Storm Pioneers as well, those fa flares here. Good catch from him. He's trying to get damage against this building. Doing some damage, but not enough at least. LEG. Still firing, still on the field. Still that one. With five kills. Not that less. Nice shot again. Two more kills. So seven kills on the LEG. And another mine getting spotted from Caesar. Getting some repair as well, probably soon. Was not the best wire here from the hooligan. Didn't destroy the green cover. Oh, it could be a dead pioneer. Gets out in time. Oh, looks like we're seeing a Caesar just get ready to set up his T4 building on host control point and fuel point. Probably getting catched from those conscripts, which are now in range here. Get out before he gets oppressed! No, but it's almost out of range, so could maybe get out without retreating. No, you have to retreat. Folks are able to get some few back. Very risky to stay in this building still. It's uh, almost down. But Caesar don't care. He just says, well, you don't will bring my MG down in this building. I am faster than you. Even you getting it. I can't I can do that. It's not a problem for me. Mm, double Maxim. Nice uh, positioning here. Oh, Bobby just is enough to getting uh, those both cons, uh, folks. After retreating the one Maxim at least. He's not retreating it, he's just reset it. Flamer in kind of point to getting some flames in. The forks. Oh, is it enough? Last shot? No, it gets out in time. Just one unit getting destroyed from the breaking building. So, MG re rescued again. Caesar just was in time outside the building. One second later, and it would be a dead MG 32. Bet you, flag half frag now in the field. With eight kills. Not that useful, but at least could handle most kind of vehicles here. You're seeing a good AT gun shot, also that one now. You have to smoke to get out of this range. Another shot goes in, but was too far away and didn't hit it. Two sneaky Rakidnaros around. It's really one of the worst things which could happen to Hooligan because those kind of guys could be everywhere on the map. So if he's not aware about his T70, the T70 could go down instantly. Easily. Nice grenade from Caesar. Just missed because he thought he goes into the green cover and now is in the own fire from the Hooligan's Molotov to Nate. Nice shot from the LG again. LG doing a good job here. Cleaning the MPs from everything. We have now two LEGs on the field on this map. Ridiculous. Annoying for the Hooligan. Like after trying to protect the munition, but he's probably not able to get it in time. Don't you get it? T3085 on the field right now from the Hooligan as well. So first big vehicle here out. There's a mine. So maybe... No, he spotted in time. So maybe he's just... Uh, Hitting the mine, I was saying, but it will not happening. So T85 is the uh, worst thing for Caesar right now. He's decked. He's decked still. He could getting a panther out, what he's probably trying to get now, or an Jagdpanzer. 
I think just he's going at least for for the Panzer because it's more mobile and he have the munition for that, uh, the fuel for that. And the Panzer is the perfect counter against those T85. Oh, probably a big push from the T85 here right now. You're seeing here first kind of reaction. Misses both shots. You can't push it without Rakitens, it's very risky. And Rakitens are all in the middle at the moment. So he can't really do a lot here. He could probably getting one or two shots from the one Rakitens up. He's probably showing the bats to those Rakitens. No, he's just not in time. Ready to shoot. He's again trying to push here. Getting some shots in. First shot hits perfectly. Another wire, a flare, the wire goes off. Get another shot in. No, it's out of range. Nice T4 building, protecting like it should be the complete field point. Oh, T17 trouble. He's outside. Can he get another shot from the rockets? Looks like not. He's out of range. One AT gun goes down. T35 goes to protect it. And there's no supporting weapon to help out here in this situation. A nice shot from the Rakitens, but not enough here. He's trying to probably get the Maxim and just decrutes, but it's risky, the T-85 just hiding there, waiting to get all other control. Mine, Seeing a mine again, goes off, not, not see where. Very even game, Caesar and Toligan, the VPs are looking very even at the moment, so could be in both hands falling, no one loses a big vehicle or light vehicle, so all vehicles are still on the fields, as well as all units. Both have perfect micro at the moment, we are reaching at the moment the minute 23, and we are now at minute 25, most likely first um, kind of units will be fall down, because big vehicles will on the field, and that's just what happened right now. The Panther arrives finally the fields. And that's the way what could be changing the game here. Panther is ready to fight and dealing with the T-85. And uh, we're just seeing, meanwhile the Panther is on the field, that the Holigan could be building some uh, perfect counter for that. But he's not building anything at the moment. He probably waits for the IS-2. He could be going for an SU-85. Or another T85, which could be helping. But let's see what he's going after he's seeing the Panther. Panther is now in range of the AT gun almost. Could be not hitting it, it's just outside, so close. See, he's switching around. No, he's not reacting. AT gun just stays the way it is. Panther's not sure where to go at the moment. Like a frog, ready to rumble again. Rumble the enemies, the bodies into death. T34 85 found the fork spread, Nadius, which you have to retreat on the downside. But there's a Raketen hiding. Panda just switching again the direction. Panda with a nice kind of skin around. From the artists. Oh, Panda found the T-85, but the A-85 gets a perfect hit in as well as two AT guns. Good shots. Panda needs some repair to get back into the fight. Storm Pioneers are just able to get in in time. Don't seeing anything built from the Holy Gun. He's probably really waiting for the IS-2. Rocket launcher set up in time. He realizing it and just go back. Oh, getting sh shot at. Could he get hitting it? He got. No, he does it. So close. Just moving around again. Nice move from uh, the hooligan. Trying to get a good flank in against those MG. There's only one MG left, but there is the puncher back on the field. Almost repaired. 
getting a nice thing up. He could be destroying the MG. Is he going for it? No, he don't get it. Getting suppressed from... Uh, I don't know what it was, but getting suppressed. Gun crew getting decrewed. So a T gun down from Caesar. He have nothing to take it at the moment, but he could push him. We're seeing the T85 going for a push here. Is it the end of the fight? We don't know. He's not going for the push. He could be. He's trying to destroy the Raketenwerfer. He could be pushing downside, but he's not trying to go for that. T17 now around there. Are we getting some few up? No, nope, just sit there. Panther getting some love repair. He's trying to get the ra the Raketen. Don't go in for it. Is he trying to destroy it? Oh, nice try of the shot from the Panther. Didn't hit in time. Oh, this could be dangerous. Nice shot, destroying the Raketen instantly. And that was a big MP lose for Caesar. A T gun down. Sadly, lose from Caesar. So he has now only one AT gun and one uh, rocket launcher on the field. And that now to dealing still with the T-85. And there's soon coming the big IS-2. He's just waiting to call it in. Ten fuel left. So only a couple of seconds before the big brother comes and help. Help to get those Panther destroyed. Showing who's the boss on the field. Seeing a little push on the top side, but there's still the flag half track around, so he will easily just uh, countering that. There's also some AT mine. Nice uh, pickup from the uh, Maxim, getting from the double Ellie ILG destroyed. Still trying to get the MG back. He don't need it really, but I think three M Maxims are better than two Maxims. So better have one more than one less on the field. Good push here on the top side, seeing double forks, almost a uh, bet for both of them. But have to retreat against those uh, blob of T-70. A single blob of one vehicle. Trying to dealing with those kind of things. Oh, it's a nice push here. He's trying to get those Flag half truck under control. There's no Panther around. You could pushing it at the moment. Is he going for it? No, he's not going for it. There's a could be mine. One mine is around there, so it's risky. Ice two. The big one is now there. It's ready, ready to destroy everything here. This is the right thing, which helps now. Is he pushing? Is he going for the Panther fleet? Getting a nice big shot in, Rakit Refer bounced it, but the Panther don't bounce. Another Rakit Refer shot and missed as well, not. Need some repair, but he's still able to fight in the battlefield. Maxim fighting those cons, those folks. Folks will be winning the fight because of the better cover situation here. Second, Maxim don't care uh, to help. Black like Aftrack decided to help here a bit, but this could be risky. The AT gun is just to have to move a bit around. And then the Black like Aftrack is in trouble. Panda's trying to fight here. Oh, almost get the a Faust in. But it was a bit too far away. 34, 85. Able to shot probably the building. Misses. See maybe a barrage soon from the sis. I still need repairs, seriously. Barrage again in from 180 gun. Don't hit anything. Gets out in time. Building getting some shots in. Seeing the flag half track is getting another big shot in. Gets out in time. Oh, he's stucking. He got going for it. Where is the punter? Far away! He's not going for it. Two VPs going in the hand from the holding again back. VP is still even, also the units on the field are still almost even. We're seeing a couple more of uh, normal force enemies on the field for Caesar. 
but what was he doing next? It looks like he's he's looking forward for a uh, tiger, maybe. He's just stopped his builds he was going for, and now he's probably thinking about what to do next. He could getting a P4 out, another Panther out, or something else. He have free way, but he have not the free space of units at the moment. Pop capped almost with 86 units. Meanwhile, the holy gun is completely pop capped. Can't building anything. Could just um, get some space, some some banking as resources for uh, bad times. Before it could be built it now, but he's not going for it. We don't know what Caesar thinks at the moment. Trying hard to get the VPs under control. Eyes to getting in range of the Red one Raketenwerfer, the only Raketenwerfer which is on the field at the moment. Very risky with only a Panther and one Raketenwerfer to deal with an IS-2, a T-85 and two AD guns. That's a lot of stuff you need to do. But what did we see here? Is that not one, it is not two, it is the Pack 43 the big gun, the tank counter, the unmobilized biggest a T gun in the World War II. Almost finished build it and will probably switching the place. And he's just arranged it, a perfect hit into the ice 2 ice 2 after hitting instantly. Getting a nice shot in. Another shot goes in. He's following, he didn't catch it probably. A T gun is in range. Is he going for it? Can you see it? A T gun not shoot at the moment. Sadly not. Panther tries to flank a bit with the T-85, which is also like from a T-gun, and another T-gun is around, so Panther could be in trouble here right now. Two AT guns shooting, one pounced. T-85 missed, also the another T-gun missed. Luckily, Panther, he could be just much more in trouble here right now. What will Cedar do next? He could taking up to T-2, T-3, or whatever it's called. Or just get some other big vehicle out, but you don't have the pop cap to do that. T85 probably trying to cap here. Looks a bit like so. Use that one. You could just using his ability secure mod and capturing the territory. But there's rocket in time. Getting a nice shot in. Panther reacting instantly to that, Rakete misses, but maybe the Panther were moving, no he's not going for it, there could be mines and there are mines in the retreat pad as well, so it's a risky thing, Caesar don't want to risk anything in this game, he wants to win this game on the safe mod. LEGs still both that 3 and that 2, we see a level, uh, an, uh, 7 kills and a 27 kills units. That's a lot of damage he did. Double shooting everything around the map. Annoying probably a lot those kind of AT guns. Maxims are at the moment really the point. He needs. Is he stopping there? The build? Probably. Trying hard to get the VPs back under control here. Caesar have a little bad time here to get those kind of points because of the maxims which are everywhere the hooligan completely pop capped Caesar are also completely pop capped and those little big vehicles on the field that will be stopping tank pushes from the hooligan he have nothing to deal with that at the moment you need Katusha but he can't build a Katusha that's a bad thing you have to lose something but what can he lose? He needs every unit on the field. Very bad situation here. Another push here from Caesar. Seeing a first big artillery goes in. Zeroing artillery. That will be a big one. 
Let's see if he's getting the AT gun down. No! Gets out in time. Maybe the Pioneers dies in the retreat? Also there he's lucky and gets out in time. But gives at least he's a time to get the middle VP under control back. Meanwhile top side is under control from the Holy Gun with a nice two hiding as well as an MG Maxim in the building. And the Penny are sneaking around in cover. And quietly talking to each other about plants. And a G perfectly take down three of the units from those Maxim. You have instantly to retreat here. Too risky to stay against two LEGs. The fire rate is too high. Nice explanation from uh, the flag after to see what's around there. Getting a shot in and the panther could just moving in after that to realizing what's happening here. But nice counter from the conscripts who are in and getting engine damage to those panther. Panther have to go outside. The AT gun is not set up right, so he can't get another shot in. And I can never get just out of time. Oh, anything is getting destroyed. I didn't see it. The T-70 goes down in the middle from the big Pack 43, which just have now one killed vehicle on count. Big loose here. He wasn't aware about that. And the Pack 43 says, "We found a vehicle. Let's aim." <laughs> Nice uh, back cap from uh, the Force MDs on top sides. The Maxim are looking in the wrong direction, whatever. He could be still taking this under control. I still miss his shots. Don't take down the Force ideas. What Caesar probably will not see to lose the Force idea. Four Force ideas are perfectly almost all that five. One is just hitting it right now, Red 5, pushing an AT gun, and big AT gun is at the moment a little bit of trouble, but he's not going for the push, he tries just to hold and decapping the fear points. Katusha, meanwhile, from the Hooligan, finally in build, after he loses his uh, T-70, he has the space, the pop cap, to getting it up, this will be changing a lot of stuff, the pack 43 will be in danger after this uh, is on the battlefield. Uh, seeing some ice two shots in. Ice two don't get really penetrated a lot. A lot of not penetrating shots. All bounces just. Ice two front armor big. And we're seeing first barrage from Katusha trying to take down the pack 43. Don't doing enough damage probably to take it down. Getting at least some couple of damage, but it's not enough probably to destroying it. Map control still even. We're seeing uh, the Holigan and Caesar at the moment trying th the hardest. Map control VPs. Th it's not even clear who could winning this. We have an ice tier on the field from the Holigan. We have a Panther on the field from Caesar. And a T85 from the Holigan as well. Looks like Caesar decided to take up finally. He probably goes now for the decision. Okay, if I'm losing too much, let's go for the King Tiger. The biggest tiger in the world. And there's just the... At the moment the truck goes up. He will probably set it up around this base here and get some repair um, push as well for all the vehicles which are on the field. He has still managed to hold his light vehicle alive. That's very... Um, amazing to have a half track and flag half track in the late game will be helping to take down those IL2 strikes which get could getting in if um, the holding can decide to use it. So this is a good point for him. As well, he have his um, flag um, T4 building which could also dealing with those uh, IL2s. Nice flame grenade in the retreat of the building. Probably takes down the complete mat vetted Maxim here. He could be getting it. Is he focusing it? It looks like he's focusing it. And he could just getting a, ma a free Maxim if he goes for it. Or just taking the resources for it. Is he going for it? No, he just decided to get the MG, the Maxim. Now it turns just complete around. Caesar have now three MGs. Wow. The Holy can only have two MGs. So far as it could go. The switching between. Seeing another shot in. This time not at the... 
pack. Still a couple of shots hitting the pack. Could be enough to deal with the pack if another shot gets in. But looks like it's safe here. T85, that too. Trying to get the downside back under control with some help of the conscripts. But conscripts running in, trying to get some AT grenade probably up, but don't getting it in. Covered, exploded, and the flag after that just instantly, most likely taking all those units down. It's just almost nothing he could do with it. Misses the last shots and survives. Meanwhile, the AT gun is in positioning. He could just getting the last shot in and the flag after like that four just reached. Exploded in a hell of a big burning smoking area. You're seeing an AT gun, uh, that three now on the field as well. That's very good stuff for the hooligan to deal with the punter, which getting in slightly trouble, but this also gives Caesar the possibility to get most likely not yet, but later some uh, big cut King Tiger on the field after using some more infantry probably on the field. And the Tiger, King Tiger with uh, Panther support is ridiculous strong. VP is still even. We are 41 minutes on in the in the game right now. Both probably just trying her best to dealing with all those ve ve uh, vehicles and also units. But at least they don't getting really any kind of good shot in. Vehicles, most shots just bounces on all vehicles. He misses again. This one not. Getting prepared while shooting. That's a very nice idea from Caesar. Can't hitting the storm pioneers. So Panzer in a good positioning here. Could be pushing here. Is he going for it? Looks like he's trying to get the IS-2 down. He's seeing the low health here. Misses a shot. Is he still going for it? No, he's not trying to go for it. It's too risky to lose the Panta vet too. Takes him too long to get those vet up. Rock hidden there for a, a weird positioning here. Not stealthed. Not sure why. Should be. Probably just shot any shot in. Another rocket launcher. Cartucher attack. Trying to get those... A T gun and those RLG down, but it misses all the shots, just one shot, hit it, the pack 43, which probably was not even available anymore for, for doing some good damage, and that's not even bad, because now he is able to get a King Tiger in, and this will be probably changing the game again completely, and brings Caesar a better way to commandate the field. MG running around. Oh, there's some little catch against those that two racket never, which getting hit it and destroyed. That is really sad. Caesar decided to not build a, a Twin Tiger. He decided to get a P4 out. And now we have a little kind of problem because all his AT is almost done. Pack 43 is at the moment decreased. There's nice two two AT guns. Uh, T85, another T34 on the build, as well as the Katusha. Wow, he could just dealing with most like of, th of these things here. We're seeing an AT gun just moving around, very weird decision here. A gun crew has been lost. Busy on the left side, probably. Engine damage here, You're seeing a Maxim goes down. That was probably the stolen Maxim from, from uh, Caesar. Nice two, probably getting a shot, a shot in here, are we shooting stuff? No. He could take him down those kind of thing here with any AT gun, he's trying again probably, not sure what, what he was, why just moving back. Is he trying to get it down? Looks like so, no. It's probably bugged, it looks a bit like so. <laughs> we have a P4 on the field, a weird decision from Caesar, but probably he wants something, um, faster than a King Tiger to dealing with those infantry. Nice Katusha hit, could be taking down the MG, getting out in time. He gets out in time, could just hiding behind the building and getting in back after that, if he want to try that. Nice big hit here, Katusha don't do a lot of damage against the against the building. There's a big uh, villa, which is around. He just decided to, to um, get out at the building and positioning again. Getting some good shots in from the conscripts, but conscripts are now suppressed. 
T34 tries to get it on field, but he don't have the pop cap to doing it. Too much on the field. So we can't call in the T85, uh, no, the T34. It's not working. Before turning around, Panther repaired again. Before is not able at the moment to to get any really good engagement up. Getting some shots against tanks, but that's it. Low AT gun, you should be repairing or at least healing it if it has still four guys up. Panther trying to hold this point. AT gun is up here, can't shooting here. It's probably um, not seeing it through the building. Oh, nice hit against the P4. P4 good going down here. Is he in range still? He gets it and last shot. P4 dead. Perfect. Good. AT gun that 3 from the Holy Game. Takes the P4 almost in the first engagement down. That is said, Caesar have now probably just throw away his last chance to have a good point here. Pack 43 is just the decap back from Caesar, but he knows that the Holy Game knows that there's something up. And Caesar have now to decide what to do next. He needs time. He needs time to get something big out. The King Tiger would be a possibility after all. He just have tacked off three buildings. He have the fuel for sure for a King Tiger. Nice shot against the Ice 2. Ice 2 is still pushing. Is he trying now to to push here more? Seeing it, he's shooting again. Another big shot goes in. Ice 2 in trouble. Moving weird around. Another shot probably hits very soon from the AT gun. It hits again and Ice 2 now in big trouble. Is Hodigan throwing away here at the point? Panda needs one more shot. It didn't penetrate it. Missed. Panda still pushing here. Hit and Ice 2, that 2 goes down. Big mistake from the Hodigan. Turns around the game again back after this good shot against those P4. Nice push here against the Maxim. Uh, Fox Energies are able now to pushing those Maxim away. Maxim will probably going down the retreat path. Panther just scared, goes away, we're seeing a T-34 on the field, the T-85 goes also down, I didn't see that get uh, down uh, at any point here. Another shot in, just uh, spreaded around those battlefields here, hopefully hitting something here. He's trying at the moment against the Lila G's, getting one shot in, LGs G's and still <laughs> that 4 and that 2, it's crazy, surviving both without a lot of trouble. Caesar now in a good positioning here. He's uh, have all those stuff on the field he needs. We need a new IST on the field from the Hooligan. Sadly, he, he uh, loses his first one and brings him in a bad situation after all against this bad three Panther. But also, Caesar don't have a lot on the field. We have only the Panther to counter those vehicles. If the Panther misses and the pack is not in, in uh, positioning, he will have not a good time. Almost another triple cap from the Holigan. So the piece are at the moment a little bit in the hands from him. If he can stay long enough in it. He could just let Caesar bleed and then Caesar have to push harder. Much harder. Nice try from Caesar, but he didn't this thought there will be any AT gun around. Ooh, Panther is in a bit of a dangerous here. Big AT gun shot, nice position from uh, Caesar. Is he trying to Faust it? He could going for it. No, he was just in range but didn't use the possibility to do that. Seeing Maximum in the top side here. Caesar trying to get at least one VP back under control because he's bleeding a lot with his triple cap. He needs to clean this building with um, some grenades. And we're seeing just now Another Katusha attack. Katusha red one still doing more and more damage slowly and almost red two. That's a good point here. But don't hitting enough here to dealing with it. Sadly thing he can't reinforcing the pack 43 if he has no bunker around or so. Oh, Panther decided to push here through. It's risky, there could be mines around this place here. Sadly there is no mine. But uh, IT gun, Vet3 could be going down here. 
He's not deciding to, to move around. T34 making a very weird move here. Don't know what he decided to do here. Panther decides. No, he don't push us. 50 points only left for Caesar. Caesar have slowly trouble to get the VPs under control. He needs two VPs right now. He's getting the downside, but the middle one is very hard to get through those uh, Maxa, which is just around there. Top side back in the hands from the Hooligan, and only 45 VPs left to go. Caesar going for another P4, he now is the time he had, is not enough to get a KT out, he needs something now. And so he decided to get a P4 out, and this P4 could be the game changer again, or he just misses and will be finally get those kind of situation back. We're seeing some planes going up here, and suppressing everything probably, with the LA2 strike. Big, big situation here. Panther in trouble, getting engine damage, rammed from the T-85, double AT guns, wet three both. One bounces, the other one mid hisses, another one hits. Ice 2 trying to push as well, second and last AT gun shot hits the field and we're seeing Ice, IL-2 going still up. Caesar probably losing now as well, the building MG, wet 5. We're seeing a big push in the middle now, Caesar have no time, you have to get now the points. You don't have time to get the control left. We're seeing a P4 engine damaged. IO2 strike going still up. We're seeing still the MG and the building is up and he's not going for outside. Caesar just said, okay, you die, whatever, I don't care. And now we're getting the control back from the downside. We're seeing still the control is on the top side. Panther could be pushing if it would be a Panther, but the Panther is dead. He dies in the downside. P4 could be getting away. There's nothing pushing at the moment for it. Double AT gun tries to get uh, some fuel here. Is he in time? Up? Set it? No, he gets out again. So AT guns have to just rejoin him here. AT guns shooting weird against those um, manual shots. Longest range. Trying to hit some, some P4 here. This cost him 1 AT gun with 3, what was not that useful. Gun um, controls are at the moment more or less in both ends, but the Hooligan have finally most likely the VP points under control. Have another point up again, 26 points left for the Hooligan to go. Caesar is in a big trouble here, he can't lose any VP anymore, he can't lose any VP. He's probably get, trying to get the middle one again. Pack 43 is still recruit again. DK was successful. VP stays on 20 for Caesar. Another Katusha shot. You see hitting? Top side. He now Caesar have to stay there. So is he getting it in a retreat path? No! He gets out in time. But he could get the VPs back under control. A T gun, he just decided to destroy it. The Hooligan don't need an AT gun, he needs units and more tanks. That's what the Hooligan needs. And Caesar needs more or less tanks. He have only the P4 on the field. And the P4 have a little kind of trouble if the Ice 2 gets attention. Another unit guys from season big artley goes in Units consolidate. We are down to 10, points. 10 points left two vps under control he just stays into the points and it looks like that caesar gives the way gives the away the game finally it was a very close game in the end caesar doing some mistake losing the panther Losing a P4 as well, should probably be going for a King Tiger and then a better possi possibility here. And there's the GG, Caesar just loses to 0 VPs, it was a very long game, 54 minutes into that. Caesar tries a lot and was just in the end not strong enough to dealing with the big IS2, the second one which was on the field.